Hi guys, it's Faith here. I hope everyone has had a wonderful cri Christmas, New Year, and 2018. I can honestly say that my 2018 has been relatively good in terms of my YouTube channel. I am coming on here with an audio video with some visuals to talk to you about s some stuff. And, you know, things I might want to quickly say or get off my chest for 2019. Firstly, um, I would like to say thank you to all the people who have subscribed to me over the year. I cannot believe I am at 175 subscribers, or maybe more by the time this video goes out. Secondly, I want people to know that I am at university, so that will be taking up most of my time with projects and stuff. For this reason, I am going to limit my days on when I upload a video to maybe two days, unless it's a birthday video, which has to come out on the day of the birthday. Speaking of anime birthday videos, I am finishing up the Diabolic Lovers birthdays with Cole in January. And finishing up the Yu-Gi-Oh! 5D's birthdays with two that I missed last year. Which is Jax in January and the twins, Leo and Luna, in June. So yes, you'll be getting two anime birthday videos this month and one in June. Then, probably in 2020, I will be restarting the anime birthday videos with a new anime. I'm thinking maybe Ultrano Prince Summer, since there are quite a few characters in that anime that I could easily do a birthday for. Well, birthday video for. Thirdly, I want to address the whole thing with Article 13 and what it could mean for my channel. Now, I honestly don't have a clear idea of what Article 13 is about, only that it could mean that I may or may not be losing my channel due to it. Again, I don't have a full idea, so I don't know. There is unless they change it slightly to so it's more friendly to channels like mine and a few others. I'm hoping this is the case, because that's a lot of content that I'm going to lose. And I don't actually make money from this content. This is literally just a creative outlet, um, which I use to basically sort out my brain in a way, and I'll be explaining that in my fourth point, which we'll get onto now. So, fourthly, um, for those who don't know, I am autistic, meaning that some things I will have trouble, there will be some things that I actually have trouble with, like understanding certain things, like Article 13, when you're joking or being sarcastic, I may not realise that you are doing this, and I will take some of this to heart. So, yes, I am a little sensitive to those certain things, but I can take criticism. So, if you do have something that is bothering you with my channel, or something you dislike, maybe in the video, you are happy to tell me. I will take it on board, because otherwise I won't actually grow. I'll grow slowly in terms of, like, how good the content is. But I won't really grow in terms of, like, maybe certain things that are wrong, or I don't know. But I'm just going to say I can take criticism. Also, because I am autistic, I, I can feel quite childish in some ways, which is why most of my content is children's TV shows, like with Thunderbirds and Teenage Mutant Ninja Turtles and a few others. Um, but these were shows I watched as a kid, and that's why I do them, so yeah. I am also random in some ways, which is why my channel has the random vid series, which is going to continue because I like doing the random videos because I get to show off a bit of me, in a way. Leading on from this, some of you may have noticed within like the last month or so um, of 2018, I was experimenting with masks 
An example of this would be the Oliver and the Thunderbirds video, which you can probably see playing to either the left or the right. Um, which is where Oliver was appearing in random places in the Thunderbirds universe, like on Thunderbird 5, Gordon's lap, hanging out with Sherbert and a few other things. I've been trying these out because I have always adored people who have the skills to create amazing animesh videos. Animash videos. Um, to list a few was, these are the three main ones I can think of, but there are many others that I have watched and I really wish I could credit them on this. But the three I'm going to list are Queen Nala, and forgive me for Queen Nala, Kiara Mar Bel Bolto, and um, Finn G. Sorry if I pronounced that wrong. Part of me has wanted to try and do an animation video, which is what my first experiment with masks video was an attempt of. Um, I will be experimenting, experimenting more with masks this year when I had when I get and have the time to. Um, what you are seeing either to the left or right of me again is not is a not so rubbish edit of me as an animesh character. Now I chose Rue from Winnie the Pooh because Rue was one of the main characters I connected with while growing up. I loved Rue in Piglet's big movie along with the song that came with it. Um, and growing up I discovered that a lot of people connected the characters of, from Winnie the Pooh to mental disorders and although this did kind of like ruin it for me, because Rue was apparently connect is apparently connected to autism in some people's view um, and although I'm not as hyperactive as Rue, I guess that's why I connected with her because of this, not saying that she is autistic because as much as I do admit, Pooh does have an eating disorder. Um, I don't really... It's nice to know that maybe um, Rue is autistic. I don't really know, but that's all I'm going to say on the subject. But this is why um, I'm, I am I am Rue in this um, picture. Um, and no, this is not really what my hair looks like, but I am not that good with editing, so it's a rough way of putting my hair. Okay, um, the final things that I am going to point out is um, any, like, if people wanted, wanted me to do collabs with them or anything, you just need to message me um, or in the comments or some in some way get in contact with me. Um, through maybe the chat thing that YouTube has, which I've only just discovered, I'm going to be honest. Um, secondly, if you do have any requests, like someone requested maybe me trying out a Miraculous Ladybug um, AMV, I am actually thinking about it, if, but if you have any other like requests of like the animes that I am doing, as you can see, I've um, started exploring the Yu-Gi-Oh! 5Ds and I started including that into the videos that I am doing. Just, again, let me know in the comments of my latest video or whatnot and I'll see what I can do. Finally, um, in terms of the Met video, which you'll probably be seeing again to whatever site it's on, um, this map is open until February, um, I would like you to have your parts done by February. If you do need a little bit more time in the Feb in the first week of February, that is perfectly fine. Um, but I, um, the whole reason I put this one out is because um, I was actually doing it for a birthday video that takes, I wanted to do it as a birthday video that takes place in February. Um, and I don't really mind if only like like the first maybe 10 or 12, I don't know, first 12 parts, I don't mind, or 13, whatever parts are there. I don't mind if those, if it's just those parts that get taken and it's like half, maybe just like three quarters of a video. Um, I'm not pushing for people to like go and sign up for this, but um, 
if I have like messaged you to like invite you to come and take part in the um, map, it would be kind of helpful if you either replied saying that you couldn't do it due to certain things like one person has already had and that is actually very helpful but if you are interested in any way please just go and comment on the video um and that's all i'm gonna say about it but if this but if the certain parts don't get taken um then this map will just be taken down and i'll probably try it again at a later date um, my part, the parts I made for the video will still be up on my channel, I am not taking them down because I like them there and they're quite funny. Um, also, on maps, since I, I am also going to try out for more maps because I would like, because that was the whole reason I started doing, the sh well one of the reasons I started doing shorter videos when it came to like December and November time. Because I weren't going to have time due to schoolwork, as schoolwork and such. So I stated that I was gonna in, only going to be doing smaller videos and then I did a much longer video, was making a much longer video for Christmas. And obviously I did a longer video for New Year's, which was, which you've probably seen. But the other reason I was doing all those very short videos, like 10 seconds, 30 seconds, blah blah blah, was because I wanted to practice um, making videos or part making vi short videos for maybe parts because I am looking into taking parts in certain maps um, if I manage to find any that I'm actually interested in but the idea of me doing the also doing the short videos was so I can get practice with the um, small <laughs> um, sections of song and working with that okay i'm gonna leave it there guys because it, this is already like 12 minutes long and i don't really want to waste any more of your time but if you made it to the end of this video thank you so much um any links so like the um channels i mentioned the map i mentioned um and the videos i probably will use that I've probably shown in this, they will all be linked in the description below, um, so you can go and check those out, and that will be all for um, probably the longest video I've actually ever done. Okay, well thank you guys for listening, and I'll see you in my next video. Okay, bye!